Hey everyone, my name is Stan. I'm here with PNY and we're going to show you how to install an SSD in a desktop system. So first thing you're going to do, uh, remove the bolts if you have them, take off the cover, And now at this point you're going to want to ground yourself. You always want to ground yourself whenever you're working with any sort of electronics. All you need to do is touch the metal part of the case and you should be fine. We're going to take the inside of the case and we're just going to open it up in our lab bench here just to make it easier for everybody to see. So we've got our SSD here and what we're going to do is it's got two plugs, desktop, SATA plug and a power plug. The power plug connects to the power supply and the SATA plug connects to the motherboard for this, where the SATA ports are, which are right here on this particular motherboard. All you're going to do is plug in the SATA cable. They're keyed so they uh, will fit only one way. Once you plug it in on both sides, you've installed your SSD. Since every desktop system is different, check with your user manual to make sure if you need any screwdrivers or mounting brackets before you install the SSD. Refer to your manual to determine the best way to install your SSD in your system. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions or need further assistance, contact PNY Tech Support at pny.com/support.